Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to uh, Dragon Quest Seven. All right, there's uh, just a few mini medals that I can get right now, but uh, they're pretty significant. Um, I have not figured out what my strategy is going to be with the uh, um, awards, so I'm just going to wait until the end. Um, there's bonuses, bonus dungeons. I'll have to do grinding for those, so that'll be a good time to uh, aim for getting those awards. I'm kind of guessing that the the scores of other characters are going up as you progress through the game, because uh, I kind of feel like some scores that should have won uh, didn't, but whatever. Neither here nor there. Um, I can get a total of seven mini medals right now, and as you can see, uh, Ald and Gabo have uh, mastered some monster classes, so let's go ahead and get them changed. Uh, Ald is the Rainhawk. Yes, you're reading this, the uh, title for that correctly. Uh, Gabo is Esterk, uh, Beelzebub. Uh, Ira is currently in Tamer, fairly low level, and Maribel is in Warrior. She just mastered it, so she's ready to uh, change classes as well. All right, in we go. All right, first of all, Ald, I've put a few uh, fights into what he's going to become, and that is Hell Giant. Uh, strength is going to go down, agility is going to go down, guard is going to go down, intelligence is going to go down, appearance is going to go down, everything goes down. Uh, hit points go up, yay! Uh, but the main reason that I'm doing this is because um, this and another thing will get me to a an advanced class that I want for him. So yes, become a Hell Giant. Ald will now go forth as a Hell Giant. Alright, next up... Gabo. Alright, so he's, uh done a pretty well. I got him a few levels in Curse Lamp as well, but that's not what I'm going to make him. I am going to make him a Plat King. This is the ultimate monster class. So it is nice to have uh, gotten Gabo up there. Uh, I'll work on some of the other classes as we uh, in the post game. Uh, Ira's good, Maribel. Uh, so Maribel is close to mastering a bunch of these others, but I'm still working on the uh, combined skills. Um, she has mastered Sage, Teen Idol, and Summoner. She can become a hero, uh, but right now I'm going to make her a ranger. Um, from Warrior, Strength will go down a bit, Agility will go way up, uh, Guard will go down, Intelligence will go up, uh, appearance stays the same. Uh, hip uh, defense goes down a little bit. Uh, hit points go down a bit, uh, but MP goes way up. Uh, Ranger in this game is kind of like a fighter mage. Not really sure that there's all that much stuff for her in this class, but eh, whatever. Nope, we're good. Okay, so let's go uh, get those uh, mini medals. I think someone in the uh, comments did mention some that I missed. It's not a big deal. I I was going to double check. I haven't identified all of the ones that I missed, but um, there's a few that are fairly significant. All right, the first ones... We're back here in Labras in the present. Ald, examine the tombstone. Here lies Colin the Adventurer. Ald, examine the tombstone. Amazingly, you find... You found five tiny metals. Ald obtained five tiny metals. Yep. That's why I didn't have over a hundred. <laughs> right there. 
Uh, but there's a couple others that I can get as well, and actually, I can do it from here. I just need to get out of town. Fine, I'll go back to the entrance game. I'll go back to the entrance room. Okay, so from here, um, all right, I'm actually kind of close to one of them. That's not what I want. Where is it? This is the one that I want. This shrine up here where we got um, an unknown shard. It's not in here. This guy, he says, Listen, heroes of God, you traveled back through time and defeated the dark demon lord, but your actions merely brought you, brought you time until the present. The demon lord has returned, and his cursed shadow once again is cast upon this land. There is but one path open to us. Go now and face him. Put an end to all of this. You heroes were chosen by God himself. There is nothing that could instill fear in your noble souls. God's wondrous power is with you. Never forget that. Okay, so it's easiest to identify it here. The middle one. Maybe it's back here. All checked underfoot. What? You found the tiny metal. I obtained the tiny metal. Uh, if you do a smell, you will detect that. I'm not exactly sure how else you're supposed to find that. Uh, later games will add in little sparkles, which are pretty nice. And now for the last one that I can get right now, that I know that I missed, I should say. Um, there should be... That's not where I'm looking. Uh, we'll see how many we get, and I'll, I'll let you guys know how many I should be able to have right now. As far as I know. It, it's fine, there's more than you need in the game, so I'm not that big of a... Uh, I'm not that concerned, but it is a little annoying. All checked underfoot. What? You found the tiny metal. You put the tiny metal in your bag. Yeah, so there was one there. Oi. Okay, Metal King. Give me the next items in your list, please. Welcome, I'm a collector of tiny metal from across the world. Yeah, you've brought you've got medals for me, I see. Hmm, that brings the total up to one hundred and three tiny metal. Alright, so um I think there should be four others that I should be able to find up to this point. If I've done the math correctly. Excellent, you brought me 100 medals. Here's your unknown shard. I'll receive the unknown shard. And that is the most important item that he has. Right now, Ard, I have 103 medals from you. If you bring me 105, you've got the ultimate whip coming your way. Maybe that's a Gringham Whip. That is, that is different than what uh, Ira has, yeah. Huh. Okay, so I should be able to get that right now, but I can't. Um, I don't know. I'll, I'll figure something out. Um, I know of eight more through the bonus dungeons that uh, you can get. Um... That, of course, would take me to 111. There's a total of 115 in the game, as far as I can tell. So I do not know where the others are. <laughs> uh, I'm going to have to get a checklist and actually mark off each place that I have gotten one. Uh, but the unknown shard, let's go ahead and uh, put that into the ruins.
Just so that it's not taking up space in our inventory. Open that one up. Alright, not sure which one it is. Let's see. Aha! Okay, so there are two more for that one that we need. Unless you've done something really weird with uh, that pedestal. Alright, but... I think it's about time for us to end the threat of the Demon Lord once and for all. Now let's just go to Fishbell. That's the easiest way to do it. Okay. Let's head north. And make our way to the top of the tower. Let's fall down. more treasure on this floor. Okay. I don't see anything of a note here. No treasure on this floor. And that's really what I should be doing, is just smelling every time I get to a new map. It doesn't take any MP, so... No more treasure on this floor, which I'm pretty sure there is a... There was a, uh, A mini metal in one of these side rooms, um, but I'm pretty sure I got that, so... Got no treasure on this floor either. Hello, monsters! Ogre Kings! Alright, Ald has a new uh, ability, White Fire. Let's go ahead and use that. Uh, rock throw is still good. Let's go with fight and um, go with a fight with you as well, Maribel. Yeah, they've got a pretty high defense. How does it work against that, though? They're actually still defending against that. That should have done more damage. <laughs> should have done more damage. So they're definitely resistant against that. 810 points of XP, a Maribel learned to bounce. 600 gold. So we go out here. And there are the Rainhawks that uh, Ald became. Uh, go ahead and use White Fire. I don't trust them to not use White Fire. Um, given how many of them there are, let's go with the Sword Dance and go with a Thunder Sword. We'll see how that damages. Oh yeah. Much better. One of them is still alive. That's annoying. <laughs> uh, so you might notice Gabo has very few hit points right now. <laughs> 600 points of XP, 310 gold. Oh dear. Well. Nope. Can't fall down there. Okay, so that's not the way we go down. Um, that just takes me up here. Which 
I didn't mean to go down that way. Let's see if uh, there's anything of interest out here. There's no one in these rooms, apparently. Uh, Woe Priest. This is another monster class. Uh, I have not uh, seen them. Okay, we need something better. Fire Tower is probably a good choice. It's not... It's single target, though. Oof. That is not much damage there. Yeah, they have pretty high defense. Hmm. A little worrying. But that helped. Monsters were defeated. 514 points of XP. 296 gold. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we could have gotten the items that were there. Which is handy. It's really handy, actually. Yep. We could, uh, we could, uh, still collect these. The vase was a mad pot! I was not expecting that. I will admit that I was not expecting that. Not that Mad Pots are all that dangerous at this point. 250 points of XP, 110 gold, Mad Pot dropped a treasure chest, Alt opened the treasure chest, Death Seed was found! Gabu obtained the Death Seed! I should probably use some of these at some point. <laughs> All right, let's see if there's new stuff. Yeah, there's new stuff. Are they all mad pots? They might be all mad pots. Gonna guess that they're all mad pots. <laughs> because I definitely did get the stuff that was in these. More Rainhawks. Yeah, that damage output is... And that is not what I would like. I don't seem to have any resistance to fire. Dang it, Maribel! I expect your fireball spit to work. Six hundred points of XP, a three hundred ten gold. Incredibly, Rainhawk rises and looks in your direction. Somehow it's tamed. Will you tell Rainhawk about the monster park? Yes. Rainhawk happily ran to the monster park. The face was mad pod. Luckily, Mad Pot was easy. 250 points of XP. Ah, it's gotta be Maribel. Maribel was promoted to level 37. 7 hit points, 7 MP. Maribel learned additional skills. 2 strength, 4 agility, 1 intelligence, 1 guard, 0 appearance, 110 gold. Very nice. Yep, alright. Um... I guess we just hop on down. Hi, Dracorps. Yeah, that's better damage. Dang it, Maribel.
That eyeball is disgusting. Eight hundred forty points of XP at two hundred nineteen gold. All right, let's just wee fall on down. All right, need to find a way down. Uh, oh, I guess we go into the door. Oh, there's lots of doors. Got it. <laughs> Silly me. All right. Oh, hey, treasure chest. No, don't get to that. I'll check the treasure chest. What? You found the Lar Mirror. Gabo obtained the Lar Mirror. Huh. Mirror showing truth. I wonder if in the uh, new translation that uh, becomes Rosmere or whatever they went with. Ah, just shove it in the bag. I'm pretty sure that's a story item. Probably to uh, verify that the... Uh, that God, quote-unquote, is the uh, Demon Lord. Behemoths. Alright, no more uh, Fire Tower. Could do a, a Drag Slash, but let's do... Uh, that. Might even switch Ira back to that. So I think that the way that works is that it it's kind of like the uh, uh, multi-targeting magic spells in Final Fantasy games where... Rude. Uh, where it divides up the damage. Eight hundred eighty-five points of XP, three hundred thirty gold. I'm pretty sure someone has step guard. Yes, all does. Can 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 I? Okay, I guess I can go this way. Uh, is there anywhere else to go here? Nope. Uh, you guys again. White fire, rock throw. Let's get backflip. Actually, you know what? Uh, thunder is still better. Thunder sword is still better. Yeah, seventy damage is not bad. I'd get an extra hit out of the. Uh, um, out of Sword Dance, but I don't need it. I'd rather get the even damage, in fact. 885 points of XP, 330 gold. So much gold that I'm not really ever going to use. Alright, looks like we want to get down to that... Uh... Alright. All right, a thing that hurts, you know, it's it's fair, it's fair. I suppose I shouldn't step on the glowy, nasty-looking thing. That would probably be a wise idea. Uh, let's see. From here... just go all the way in a loop around until we find those stairs, but there's also a treasure chest up there. Hell Giants, aka Musifers. White Fire, Rock Throw, Backflip, and let's get the Thunder out again. Yeah, so it's more damage with just two. Very nice. 600 points of XP, 350 gold. What do you got for me? I'll check the treasure chest. 
Watch, you found the tiny metal. Gabo obtained the tiny metal. Let's see, so that's at 104. If we find another one, I might just uh, outside us and uh, go get the ultimate whip. Can, can I get on the throne? Is there anything behind the throne? I don't see anything. All checked underfoot, but nothing was found. Okay, I guess they didn't decide to do that again. Okay, from here... Let's see, we've got a ramp down. We've got some stairs here. Let's take these stairs first. Because there's a treasure chest. I'll check the treasure chest. The chest was Dora's box! Apparently this thing has been snacking on some candies. Alright, uh... Let us go with... Sword Dance, always a good choice. With Quad Hits. Sword Dance, and... Fire Tower. It's got pretty good defense. Kinda sucks. <laughs> Sleep here. Oh, crap. Dang it. Dang it. Good. All right. And it's dead. 630 points of XP at 280 gold. I don't like those things. No one was defeated, so I don't need to replace any of my life stones. Alright, uh, before we go looking for the way down, let's look for another chest. I'll check the treasure chest. What? You found the tiny metal. Gabo obtained the tiny metal. Well, you remember what I just said? Maribel cast outside. <laughs> How convenient! I guess we go get a new whip! Why am I using this thing when I could have just teleported? That is a good question. That is a good question. Excuse me, slime. I have important do business to attend to. Ah, you've got medals for me, I see. Hmm, that brings the total up to 105 tiny medal. Excellent, you've brought me 105 medals. Here's your ultimate whip. I'll receive the ultimate whip. Right now, Alt, I have 105 medals from you. If you bring me 110, you've got the Plat King heart coming your way. So yeah, you don't have to go through all of those other, uh, um... Uh monster levels that I had Gabo do, which he did some extraneous ones, but it it's literally, like, the end of the normal game that he's finally in that. And let me tell you, uh, in order to get that class mastered, um, so the first level is at 28, then 20, then 35, then 42, then 45, then 80, then 100. So it's going to be a little bit of time before he uh, masters that class. Just a skosh. <laughs> uh, okay, well, um... Ultimate Whip. Attack enemy group, not all enemies. Uh, that would actually be better for alt, even. 
That would be a lot better for Maribel. It'd be a bit better for uh, um, Ira as well, but Maribel's the one who needs it. I'm gonna miss a Sun fan, though. I love that Sun fan. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. Just uh, ever since uh, um, Tactics Ogre fans best weapon. <laughs> yeah, then the fan is completely superfluous now. Unfortunately, oh, sadness. In fact, this uh, Metal King sword is kind of superfluous too. Put that in the bag. Yeah, whatever. Okay, so when we come back next time, I'll get back to that level of uh, the final dungeon. And we'll see if we can work our way to Organomir himself and end his threat. But that will be next time. See you then, everyone.